hey loungers what's up and welcome back to our channel and welcome to our channel if you are new here thank you so much for joining me for today's video so as you guys can tell by today's title i'm going to be showing you guys a super cute and easy updo for toddlers so as you guys know this is miss charlie rose my soon to be a four-year-old daughter and i went ahead and detangled her hair before this video because if you don't know charlie rose is extremely tender headed so i'm going to show you guys all of the products that i used to moisturize her hair after i detangled it and then we're going to jump right into today's hairstyle this Dove Amplified Textures Moisturizer has been one of our favorites lately. Charlie has 4C type hair and it works perfect and it keeps her hair moisturized on a regular basis. And the next thing, we all love our Eco. It just helps keep those edges nice and slick and give you a good, neat finish um, for any style. I also like to use it on my hair. I have 3C um, type curl pattern, so it just works for both of us. So now, as you guys can see, I'm parting her hair and she is extremely tender headed, you guys. Like, I detangle her hair, but as you guys can see, that still did not work. And she had the waterworks coming, you guys. I try my best to go very gentle, but she just hates getting her hair done and that's just what it is. I just want to throw out there that I am not the best parter, you guys. Like, parting is one of the hardest things for me, and I really don't understand why. But, boo, your girl can't part for nothing, okay? So, I tried to get the parts as straight as I possibly could. And I even had to edit out a few pieces because it took me forever to get this one little part straight. But I tried my best, and it looked pretty straight to me, so I just kind of went with it. Link check, you guys. My girl's hair is all the way down her back, you guys. Her shrinkage is so real. I just can't believe how long her hair has gotten. But I can honestly say it comes from a low-maintenance hairstyles, you guys. I leave her hair in, depending on the style, for about two to three weeks. And then we kind of switch it up just to give her hair time to breathe. And I don't like to put too much stress on her hair. So yeah that's where the hair growth came from trust me sis i just do what i can and what works best for us because i'm no hairstylist and that's just what it is Now I know I could have done a basic old ponytail, but your girl didn't want to do that. I wanted to do something super cute and fun. So I like to do what I call train tracks, but a lot of people call it rubber band connect. So just make a ponytail and section it off and connect it with the next ponytail. So I did that in the back to just kind of give the ponytail a little bit more spunk um, and just make it super cute and just not so basic. Okay, so midway through, Charlie requested beads, and I'm like, hmm, how can I incorporate beads into this hairstyle? So I dotted, dotted. So I decided to add the little train track, rubber band connects, whatever you want to call it, and make a cute little piece in the front so that she can have her beads, y'all. She loves her beads. Look at my baby's sweet face. She was so upset. She absolutely hates getting her hair done, but she always, and when I say always, loves the end result and you guys will see that at the end of this video
So now we're going to be doing our little train track rubber band connects in the front. You guys, this is what works best for me because I am not a braider. I absolutely cannot braid to save my life. So I find that these little rubber band connects are just easier for me. If you want to braid your daughter's hair down, if that's what you like, then you go right ahead. But like I said, this is what works best for me because your girl can't braid worth nothing. Okay. Um, also, when I do these, I like to make sure it is not too tight because you're connecting it to the next piece of hair and you don't want to pull your baby's hair and stress out their edges. So I like to just kind of like make sure it's not too tight so that when I connect it, it's not pulling. I don't know about your girls, but anytime I put beads in my girl's hair, I also have a one-year-old, if you guys are like girls, um, I have a one-year-old as well, and now her hair is long enough to get beads. So I don't know about your girls, but when my girls get beads, they turn into a whole nother child, okay? I don't know what type of confidence the beads give the girls, but my babies just be off the chain and feeling their self. And I absolutely love it because it's the cutest thing to just see their little personality transform. But yeah, y'all. So I'm going to go ahead, connect this, twist it up, add her beads. And the hairstyle will be almost complete, y'all. By the end of every hairstyle that I do, Charlie Rose ends up dozing off. And as I was editing this video, you guys, I was just like too tickled by her little dozing off nod in a way because I honestly didn't notice while I was doing her hair. But she was drained from all the tears, y'all. Okay guys, and lastly, we have to add our bow because the bigger the bow, the better. My girl absolutely loves bows, y'all. She literally acts to sleep in one every night. Um, and also, we're gonna be adding these super cute clips that I ordered off of Amazon. I got the butterfly ones and also some little flowers. They were super cheap. I'll put them in the description box below if you guys are interested. And they came in all different colors. And they just add just a cute little extra touch to the hairstyle. So we added these to the back and yeah, you guys, it turned out super cute and we both absolutely loved it. If you guys enjoyed this video and you want to see more videos like this, give this video a huge thumbs up. And I was already planning on dropping at least one of these videos once a month because honey trying to commit to more will be nearly impossible but i would definitely try to at least drop one hairstyle video for charlie and probably noble um as well at least once a month for you guys because i know a lot of you guys and enjoy these type of videos as you guys can see my sweet girl was extremely satisfied with her hairstyle i absolutely loved the way it turned out and so did she and as i mentioned before subscribe if you are new and we'll see you guys in our next video bye y'all